Hey, what's up everyone? Hope you're all having a wonderful time. Today we're going over how to tame yourself some capybaras. And the capybaras can be obtained quite early on. You're gonna start to make yourself the capybara pen where you can start to breed them. And from capybaras you will get tons of poop or feces that you can use to make fertilizer for your crops and farms. But you also get some fresh meat, beast hide, bones, blood and also a small chance of getting some common carcass chunk. Uh, which can be used to get even more meat hide or bones when you use it at the butcher's table. To capture the capybara you will need some medium traps and also some bait which are a lot for these ones. Basically every veggie but uh, corn, pumpkin or potato is going to be some of the earlier ones you will get. And you can find capybaras all around the rainforest where there is a water source basically uh, like rivers in the middle here or at the small lakes all around the rainforest. And once you find a baby capybara you can uh, put a trap close to it without scaring it away and then just put in some of the bait into the trap. Crouching is helpful as it uh, lowers the sound when walking around and then you just have to stand on a safe distance to wait for the baby capybara to get into the trap. They're quite sensitive to sound so you might want to scurry towards the trap as well by moving to the opposite side of the trap and then approach the capybara so it will run towards the trap instead. One thing to note here is that a grown capybara will also get drawn to the trap so keep an eye open if they start to move towards the trap it will get destroyed if one of the gross ones get to the trap and you can just simply kill them off or scare them away or you can do that before the process of capturing the baby capybara. And once the capybara is in the cage you can just simply go and grab it and now it's going to be yours to breed. And just a quick reminder that you want to get uh, one of each gender here as well so they can start to breed once you get them home back to base. And also if you have a llama you can use a wicked basket which makes it so you're able to put in the baby tames there which is a huge quality of life to have as you can just move around with them back to the base with the llama. Otherwise you will have to run back with them for yourself by carrying them. And you can start to use the llama at awareness level 15. I got a video on where to find them and to tame them. If you'd like to check it out, link for this will be in the description. Once you get back home with your capybara, simply just move them to the capybara pen and they will start to breed. And on the front of the pen you will find a feeding throat that you will have to add any of the preferred food that they like. And also to the right here you will find a water trout where you can also add some water to it. Getting a breeding pen is also really helpful as you can assign your tribesman to it and he will then just do all the work for you so you don't have to worry about it. And if you click here it makes it so the tribesmen do not store items in the breeding farm which is something that I prefer to use as the NPC will then just sort out all of these items for you uh, if you have a storage space for it like meat going to the food chest and then bones, hide, blood and all of that goes to the beast chest instead. Thanks for watching, don't forget to like and subscribe if you found this video helpful. And if you got any other questions feel free to drop a comment and I'll try to answer them as soon as I can. And with that said, I'll see you in the next one. Bye!